We have a colorful affair going on in the kitchen here today. And with who else but none other than Chef Any? Hey. Yay! <laughs> she started the show way ahead of us, actually. <laughs> but hey, you are welcome. And Thank as always, it's always very colorful when you're in the studio. Oh. Love the glasses. Thank you so much. <laughs> <laughs> Alrighty, so we've got so much here today. What are we going to be doing? You said we had uh, on our uh, menu today stir fry. What again was that? Mexican chicken stir fry with mm. rice noodle sticks. Okay. So um, I decided to give it Mexican, you know, the name here. Yeah, I added it to just to, you know, make it look a little. All right. You know. So walk us through everything we're going to be All working right. with um, here today. So we're using red bell pepper, red. carrots, spring onions, green bell pepper, cooking oil. Here is the rice and little stick. Okay. So this doesn't really take time. You just okay. soak it for like three minutes. Okay. And then we're good. Onions, garlic, ginger. What's that? Is that garlic? Yes. Garlic, garlic and, ginger. and ginger. Minced. Okay. Yes. Already minced. Already. Yeah, mm -hmm. so we have um, dark soy sauce right. here. Um, and then here are the spices, corn flour, curry, thyme, dry pepper, seasoning cubes, sugar. You know, You're always come prepared for tea. And then the chicken, of course. Ah, so. the main deal here. <laughs> chicken, chicken breast. Uh, yes. Chicken breast. Boneless. Uh, boneless. Could it be any other part of the chicken? Um, for this recipe, no. Oh, okay. This is the best. So yeah. I'm not a chicken person. I will eat today's one, though. <laughs> but... Could I use turkey instead? I you can use turkey. turkey, you can use gizzard. The last time I made at home, I used gizzard, and oh, it was nice. Oh, fantastic, yes, fantastic. Yes, okay, yes. grand, grand. So mm. I always like to ask if this is like a breakfast thing or a dinner thing. Yeah. Or... Like I said, um, the first time I came here, mm -hmm. this is Lagos, this is Nigeria. Everything as goes. Everything goes. Mix match. Some people eat Eba in the morning, as long as it works yeah, for them. Yeah, I eat Amala in the morning. Everybody knows this already, <laughs> yeah. And it is so light. <laughs> like, this is really light and healthy. Okay. So it would go for breakfast, brunch, any kind of meal. All right. Well, yeah. fantastic. So mm -hmm. how are we going to get started? Already we had our, so we've had our pots already steaming yeah. because we want to get this right off the bat. So how are we going to start? What are we going to do? We were going to defrost the chicken yeah, because we'll it's iced up. Yes, already. we'll okay. defrost that bowl. While um, that is sitting, we'll just, um, you know, mix this together, okay. stir fry, then mm -hmm. set the side. Mm -hmm. And then I'm sure by the time we're done, this will be ready. Mm -hmm. Everything in total should be like 30 minutes max okay. Okay. because these are veggies, you still want them crunchy. Okay. And all that. Already, let's start mixing okay. and matching and doing all of that now. <laughs> yes. Yeah, so, all right, um, so let's tell you what the ingredients that you're going to need are. They're going to be on your screen right now. There they are. Water, garlic, uh, uh, some ginger, carrot, and red bell peppers, rice noodle sticks, mm -hmm. green bell peppers, yellow bell peppers, a lot of chicken breasts, please, <laughs> salt, sugar, corn flour, red onions, cooking oil and spring onions, and some dark soy sauce, uh, hot dry pepper, and seasoning cubes. Can mm -hmm. I use anything else apart from the dark uh, soy sauce? Um, yes, um, oyster sauce. Oyster. Yes, yeah, sesame oil, mm. anything. I love oyster sauce. Yes. I put it in bread. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> what was that? I mean, I it's eat tasty. rice and oha soup. Uh -huh. That's weird. So, and, and, mm -hmm. Okay, so finally you're here as a chef. <laughs> what do you think about amala and egg? In the morning, amala egg, a little it's bit of entree. It's not about morning or afternoon. The combination is just weird. My brother I, eats eba and egg. Yeah, he eats some it's people, okay. Yeah, some people even eat um, um, beans and eba. They say the beans is that like... That is a cultural thing from the, del from the Niger Delta. It's okay. <laughs> it's it's, it's fine. Like... <laughs> it's, I don't, you people, live a little. Try something risky yeah. for uh, breakfast. Uh, come on. Try a Don't amala forget to egg. use a emodium after. No, come on. <laughs> In any case... You are going to be experiencing this with yes, us, uh, so just stay tuned. We'll take you mm -hmm. through the steps as we go. All right, let's do a little break. You guys are welcome back again. So we are well on our way when it comes to our Mexican stir-fried chicken. Mexican chicken stir-fry. <laughs> uh, mix match. Take root, thai good, thick good, thai root, one at the same. In any case, so tell us what's been happening. Okay, what so are we I doing now? I have the veggies um, slightly fried here. Okay, you're using low fire, yeah? Yes, For the vegetables. I am. Yes, I am, I, because I, I don't want them to soften before okay. we put the chicken. Okay. Now, um, I'm just um, going Try to... Try to def defrost our yes, stubborn chicken. Yes, And because for this recipe, you also need um, either chicken stock yeah. or... Well, let me tell you something. First of all, I noticed that you have plenty of light where you live. Because that chicken is really, really frozen. <laughs> <laughs> Trust well me, yeah. Maybe 20 hours a That's day. good. Yeah. Uh, I should move in. Well, you're preparing matters. <laughs> as long as you're willing to pay. However. So, yeah, I'm trying to just defrost this. Um, okay. And like I said earlier... Um, for this recipe, we need the chicken stock or okay. whatever we have. So I'm just using this opportunity oh, okay. to get flavors out here yeah, oh. while defrosting. Yes. Interesting. Um, in the next two minutes, I'm going to take this out. Everything should have been, you know, so separated. Now you're getting the flavors out by mm -hmm. trying to get some broth Not out of it. Not all that. the flavors. Well, just, uh, yeah, yeah, just now that's still going to go into our mix. What's yes. the difference if you just simply put the chicken in there without the the, the broth? Um, Is it going to change? Is it going to have any difference in taste? Yes, the flavor. It's going to be trapped in the chicken. 
it's not going to be inside of everything else? <laughs> you know, sometimes, okay, let me give an instance. When you melt butter mm. and use for something, it tastes different from when you just put it there. Yeah, so like yeah. I always say, you know, step by step, mm. the way you do things would um, give you a great result. There's a the science to your dishes. That's very nice. I, I know. Yeah, You're I know, proud. Right? <laughs> well, it's not intentional, but uh, <laughs> who doesn't okay. want good food? Yeah, you can see it's coming. I just need the broth. Okay. We can use normal water if mm. broth is not available. Okay. But, you know, you can like to be extra as I, a chef. I get yeah, you, so I get you. You can see. So once we um, have everything this way, okay. I'm going to take them out, strain and fry. Yeah. So when's, yes. that, when's that one going to come into midfield? So this, we're just going to have just going to have that as the base. Okay. We're eating it with this. No, Usually a lot of people mix it together, but, yeah. you know, okay. just want something to okay. fry. Yeah. Okay. So this doesn't even take time. All right. The water is boiling. Once it's boiled, I'm going to soak it for like two to five minutes. Okay. And then we're done. That's All right. it. All right. Fantastic. Yeah. Hey, so. guys, Mexican stir-fried chicken or chicken stir-fried. Actually, like she <laughs> insists that I say. Um, and um, it's very easy to put together. I mean, even I can do it. Mm -hmm. so, hey, let's take you through those ingredients again once more so you know exactly what we're playing with here. Mm -hmm. um, from the far right of the field, we have water garlic, uh, ginger carrots, uh, some red bell peppers, uh, right noodle sticks. Green bell peppers, yellow bell peppers, and also some chicken breast. On the red side, we have salt, sugar, corn flour, red onions, some cooking oil, spring onions, and also dark soy sauce. Don't forget the yeah. hot dry pepper and also seasoning. Ding, 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 ding. Let's start the match and let's see <laughs> how this is going to end. Do stay tuned. This is going to be fantastic. It's going to taste great. My only regret is that you might not be able to taste it, yeah. but you can make it for yourself at home. It's going to taste equally as fantastic, I bet you. It's the full kitchen here. We've got our performer, Alada Kwa, in the studio. And Mr. Duke, who's going to be helping us, all of us in the studio, purchase cuts. <laughs> I'm kidding, actually. But hey, um, let's not forget the signature of this part of the show, which is Chef Annie. And today, she's prepared for us from Mexico, um, a Mexican stir-fry chicken or chicken stir-fry, whichever you want to call it. It is beautiful, I must say, Thank once you. again. It's great. And I can't wait to dig in. Unfortunately, I can't do that firsthand. We're going to have to <laughs> leave that to our able men here, Mr. Aladakbo and Mr. Duke. Let me shift this over to you right mm. now. Guys, feel free to dig in and uh, tell us what you think real quick. Yeah, go ahead. Sure. Don't minzo. Just go eat yeah. like you know, the regular Maybe African person. Well. Don't <laughs> use your hand. Use your hand. So, Chef Eni, yeah. uh, this took us all of what? Less than an hour to make, yes, yeah? Yes, yes. And it's great breakfast. Mm -hmm. It's just regular stuff you guys can just get from the stores and all. Mm -hmm. What do you guys think? What do you guys think? Great stuff. Whoa. Fantastic. Great, yeah. So, how many percent off of that car now? Well, I haven't, had, I haven't had Mexican stir fry, so, but this, mm -hmm. this, this, this is lovely. Good, that's 50% oh, off your next car. <laughs> great, fantastic. All Thank right. you very much. <laughs>